The federal and Queensland governments have today really stepped up their efforts to crack down on bikey wars on the Gold Coast. Now the Gold Coast of course is a part of the country that relies so heavily on the tourism dollar. The last thing it needs is this sort of brawling between rival bikey gangs, in particular the Finks and the Bandidos. I spoke earlier to the local member for Moncrief uh, in the Gold Coast, Steve Chobo, about the extent of the problem and the action that's required. What's the involvement of the Australian Crime Commission going to mean practically? Well, look, I welcome uh, the commitment from the Minister, uh, that is the Minister for Justice, to the involvement of the Australian Crime Commission. What it means, David, is that now for the first time uh, we've really got the opportunity when it comes to these criminal gangs to use the whole suite of federal powers and federal agencies to basically augment what it is the Queensland State Police are doing. Now, the inclusion or the embedding of the Australian Crime Commission officers means that, for example, we've got at our, at our disposal uh, the coercive powers of the federal government. Uh, we've got at our disposal the Australian Taxation Office, Centrelink, you know, a raft of different agencies who can all work cooperatively with the Queensland State Police to be super effective. And those coercive powers will mean, won't they, that uh, gang members can be called before secret hearings and if they refuse to answer questions uh, they can be jailed. Absolutely. And I'm, look, I, I think that uh, none of us make any apology for the fact that when it comes to absolutely throwing the book at these criminal gangs that we're going to use every power available to us. The Australian Crime Commission is the most powerful federal crime body that there is uh, and I welcome the fact that the Crime Commission is going to be involved in helping to clean up uh, the Gold Coast and helping to drive these criminal gangs uh, out of this city because we don't need them. You know we had a, we had a civilian shot in a shopping centre uh, uh, around 12 months ago. Uh, we had 60 uh, uh, criminal members of a, of a criminal gang uh, involved in a street brawl. Enough is enough. The community's had a gutful. Uh, we've all had a gutful. Make no mistake, we are dead serious about stopping this problem. And bear in mind too, David, that this wasn't so much of a problem here on the Gold Coast until Labor withdrew the federal police and until Labor withdrew federal resources uh, from, this, from this great city. All right, Steve Chobo, we'll have to leave it there. Thanks for joining us. Thanks for your interest, mate.